Save as has changed within Photoshop and you can no longer save as a JPEG. So where has that feature gone? Today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you the difference between save, save as, and save as copy within Photoshop. And I'm gonna start right now. So if you go ahead and download the brand new Photoshop, you might notice that you can no longer save a JPEG within the file save as window. Now this was really frustrating to me. I just couldn't work out where it gone, but they've actually moved it. It hasn't disappeared, they've just simply moved it. So let's say we've got this photo here. If I go to file and drop down to save as, you'll notice if you go to the format window here and you go ahead and click Photoshop, you'll notice there is no JPEG. You've got JPEG 2000, you've got PNG, you've got TIFF, but you haven't got JPEG. So where's it gone? So if we go ahead and cancel this, what we can do is go to file, and now what we'll do is we'll go to save as copy. Then if you go to the format window, click Photoshop, you can see you have got JPEG. Now, why has Adobe done this? Well, they've done it because you don't want to over save your original raw photo with a JPEG, especially an edited one. You want to make sure that you always have your original photo, then a copy of your changes that you've made. Now, the reason Adobe have done this is because when you go ahead and click save as copy, it will add copy as you can see, to the end of your naming system. So you don't by accidentally keep call it the same name and then you don't replace the file. So that's why they've done it. It is a little bit frustrating. You can change the shortcuts. So if you're always used to clicking Shift Command S to save or save as, you can now change it to save as copy. Makes it a little bit quicker, but that's where JPEG have gone if you are wondering, because I meant, as I said, I found it really frustrating, but now luckily, all you need to do is just do save as copy instead of just simply save as.